Sam played in the wrong key the last song and Mike's not too pleased about it. This is just, oh, the double grip! The double thing. grip! The double grip! Oh, you place have, it on Mike's face. Put the, the finish, the finish yeah. smaller and, like, smelly, and smelly armpits. <laughs> Some of in, jungle in a very grip. tight cleanse. <laughs> jungle treatment. <laughs> <laughs> He Van Lossen experience minor <laughs> disagreements like this. Scraggins! And the big, big bog rat sex orgy. Well, now it's. Oh my leg! Laughter. Oh, we make sure really, aren't we, mate? Yeah, yeah. Stand by. Look, no, we reconcile our differences Press the now. Mmm. Remember, remember that time we played in Norwich? I do. Yes, what a nightmare that was. Because yes. I was in, I was in that band, Decadent Herbs, wasn't I? That's and then right. Everybody in the bog rats came That's up. That's right. It was, it was quite a stage invasion. A stage invasion. Quite a chaotic event, really. <laughs> that was the, that was part of the um, the band, the talent show. Turgid Lemmings contest yes. at Norwich University. Turgid Lemmings. Yeah. And I, I think we took the cake crew, didn't we? Good. My game was absolute zero nothing, marks. Zero marks, I seem to remember. <laughs> absolutely nothing at all. Which actually wasn't the lowest mark, so it was in some no, ways some, even more of an some insult. Some people got minus marks. Is that you, Yeah. Yes. Yeah, Jeremy was here as well. Come on, Jeremy, go on in the interview. Yeah. Yeah, I'll get some drink. <laughs> I'll get it first. I remember actually. Did you get blue for us? I never got a blue. I was getting green. Come on, stick with oh, the subject. We're in no, I'm, sorry. I'm sorry. Come on then. Yeah. I, I just remember. Um, being very drunk. Uh, rushing on stage kicking that terrible band of what were they called? Uh, the, the, ones that, uh, the ones that are doing yeah. really well in Austria or something. Yeah, yes. somewhere obscure. <laughs> yeah, it's really funny that. Decadent herbs are really big in Austria now. Yeah, but they're still shit over here. Yeah, but anyway, it's absolutely about the nothing rats. to do with the bog rats. No. Right? No, the bog rats are what we talk about. Yeah. How many people were on stage then? It was about. Oh, a good 15 or so, I would say. What, 30? 30. Yeah, okay. it's all egomaniacs and all, all classic. E everybody. I remember having a, a very large struggle over a, uh, a, a pretty useless okay. guitar, I seem to remember, with uh, first of all the guy from the Decadent Herbs, and then someone attacked me yeah. and took the guitar from me. Um, Do you think this reflects the general makeup of, of Bog Rat members? You know, oh, completely, completely. Complete. I mean, some, it's just there are arrogant some real all over. In the Bob Rats. I think they're complete just bastards. One called Jan yeah. Glover. Yeah. I mean, he's the worst. I mean, he really. I he mean, just gets so stroppy about everything. Well, that's that's the Bob Rats. They're all up front. The Bob Rats. You know that they're all just mindless. Really. <laughs> no, I wouldn't say that. <laughs> no, not I would, no, not, not mindless. No, there is there is direction in them. Vaguely. Direction. Towards the pub. Towards the pub. Towards the bar. Um, towards the, towards the, the mushroom that's fields. Nice. Uh, well, that's you, Simon, isn't it? No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where they are. Anyway, do you here. remember that party after the Touch of Lemmings gig? I, actually, I seem to remember that I was fairly inebriated and, and I think I went off some. I drove off somewhere in a you car. You went to see... Hamani. Hamani, yeah, because we had a party afterwards. Yeah, I know. I was, Brilliant. I was after a party one. After the, um, after the... After the Turgid Lemmings contest, mm. do you remember that? We went to Cookie's house. Oh, that party there. Yeah. Beaching yeah. Road, now that's another Beaching historic Road. place from the... Legendary. Legendary, isn't it? Legendary. Right. Yeah, full of awful hippies. Awful. They're very drippish. <laughs> Dreadful people. What's Later, that girl? Kathy Green. Kathy Green. <laughs> She's the worst one. Christ, yeah. <laughs> Fairly appropriate name, really. Yeah, they're all so serious and all that sort of. Well, I think people are kind of. You're a, you're a, you're a, a genuine, caring person. If you're a genuine, caring person, that means you're a hippie, basically. <laughs> yeah, well, everyone's yeah. like hippies, really, aren't they? <laughs> Even me. Yeah, I mean, so I'm a hippie. It's filming. Hey, there's a mini, is that chat? It's filming. You, can you use it now? Slack them oh, off. Yes, what? Jan's coming back. Oh, Jan God, is the quick. worst guitar player <laughs> I've ever met. Speaking of Jan, I mean, my <laughs> he's, God. he's just coming now, so we've got to do this quickly. He's just oh. turned up with Jeanette. Yeah. And, um, but seriously, he's been trying to play guitar for five years now, so as long as I have, six oh, years. Me having a crap sounds better than <laughs> guitar <laughs> He has to tune his guitar <laughs> for him, he doesn't. He's got no idea of sound at all, isn't it? Or harmony. He's in no think, sense of time. I think what I like is the sort of the concentration. Yeah, the little thing hanging, hanging out the guy, yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah, right. No, Jan, it's the other string. No, it's oh, not but, plugged uh, in, Jan. It's no. the, uh, <laughs> that's the lawnmower outside. <laughs> he is dreadful, isn't he? 
Oh, dreadful, I don't think it's really the word. He tries, does. He, he does, does put a lot of effort into it. Mm. Unfortunately, it's misplaced effort because you'll never be able to play guitar. No, <laughs> he hasn't improved at all in six years. I think not, good not now that I can he remember. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. I mean, I suppose it does. I, I, I'm certain, actually, to be fair to him, in years to come, he will be the inspiration of many a beginner guitarist because they will think, well, <laughs> if he can make it, there's, there's absolutely no chance of me not being able to make it, yeah, really. exactly. I mean, yeah. the bog rats being as big as they are. Mm. I think people, you know, yeah. To have, young to people have say, someone... There's no point in learning to play guitar. Well, exactly. I mean, you to know. have someone as awful a musician as that fronting... Yeah. Well, not exactly fronting, just sort of generally <laughs> <laughs> taking <laughs> over the kind of stage room. Really. Um, oh, I think, you know, that's, that, that gives yeah. a, a lot of hope to people, so there is that yeah. positive side in it as well. Mm. Oh, but then yeah, we don't want to get too... <laughs> you give him credit. Oh, well, yeah, this, is, no, this is being unfair to the poor guy. Cause no, no, oh, no, no, I think we should slag him off as much as possible. Okay, right. Mm. Oh, God, now he comes now. Here he comes. Change the subject. Change the subject, quick, Norwich, quick. Norwich. 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 That was an no. interesting gig, wasn't it? Norwich was. Yeah. Yeah. With, with, was uh, that... Was, I mean, Jan was playing... Jan was playing there, wasn't he? What? Oh, no, Yang, here he comes. Yang was there, no, yeah. Um, Yang was playing at Norwich, very, yeah. Very badly, I seem to remember. <laughs> very badly, indeed. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, actually, I suppose he wasn't too bad, I suppose. Well, he was the worst player. I mean, there are several people who've never picked up a guitar before in their life, and I think Yang was the worst player than they were, yeah, quite frankly. Actually, I remember the, the, person, the person that took the guitar over from me, who I don't think had ever touched a guitar in his life, because hmm. I, was, I was there, quite happily playing... Um, um, Bog Anthem, yeah, Bog yeah. Rats Are Go, mm -hmm. I think it was, which wasn't really that because in fact no one knew the chord. <laughs> I seem to remember that there was only one chord being played, maybe yeah. two, maybe two, but uh, they certainly weren't the chords of the original song. No. And... Uh, <laughs> it wasn't a great chaos, and especially after Yann has spent so long trying to organise it before. Yeah, and it just, yeah, uh, and the guy that took over mm. was, well, it was much better than Yann, really. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think actually Jan is probably going to come over and feed me in there. No, no I'm not too bad. Yeah, that got into the conversation as well. What? You've been too mellow. Yeah. <laughs> far, far too much. Could we can. Yes, Sam? Do you want to hear me? I think Jan's in the mood now. <laughs> Focus on Jan, he's really worked up. <laughs> Look well, this is, this is just a further example of the gripe, the, the sort of the, the friction on the two sides of the band, you know. Mm. <laughs> the um, the pragmatists, me and you, yeah. and, the, and the wallies, Gary <laughs> and Jim. Oh, Feel they have something to say. Mm. <laughs> Wasting a lot of good film here. Yeah. <laughs> Nobody <laughs> knows. <laughs> <laughs> About, about the yeah, day, go um, on. East Ender yeah. with the copulating monkeys. Yeah. But you actually got the picture well, showing well, the camera. Right? <laughs> go on. What are you saying? What? You're snorting. What? Supposed to be telling a funny story. Oh, the funny story. Yeah. Oh, I was. Should I tell it to you? No. I held the camera. <laughs> well, I was. I was going along in the in a in a um, <laughs> in a um, very in funny a dirty old East Ender's truck, and he was driving me down the M4. Ha! <laughs> And we got, we were just getting into London, and um, he said, "Do you want to come in the back?" And he said, "Yeah, hey, do you want a bloody good laugh?" And I said, "Yeah, right." And so <laughs> he got out his suitcase from behind the seat like this, and sort of scrambled around it like that, and pulled out, pulled out a, a model of two, two copulating monkeys, 
And I yeah. just, uh, looked at it and he said, go on, all right, and I said, <laughs> and um, <laughs> then he pulled the models apart to reveal one, the male one with a massive great big penis, and he said, go on, look at the size of that, and I, I looked at it and he said, uh, not into that, are you? And I said, and um, he goes, well, I, I'm not into it, you know, <laughs> you know I, don't, I don't sort of um, much, you know, with women, like, you know. <laughs> no, I don't, I don't really. <laughs> Come here, and I just sat there, sort of. Well, what's what's that silly. got to do with um, uh, progress? Progress? Uh, nothing. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> nothing. Absolutely nothing. Be that. Say something now. What can we have? Nice thing. Just here we have a not so happy member of the band. Cross my way. Really, really. Check out his. No, no, he's smiling. I'm afraid. All right. Where is he going? This is possibly the most crucial meeting of modern jazz. Ah! Right. Mike here is a particular. Right, okay. right, okay. Right. 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 Is that your shot? Is it from the corner? That's where you can go. Don't stand over, stand up. Right, where did you go then? You have to stand over. What's the point? The same. Why is he pointing at the hat? I don't know. I'm not pointing at the hat. What's it? What's it? The yak. The smiling yak. Okay, we're ready to go. Yeah, we are. Right, no, give it a five, everybody, remember? Really? Don't give anything. Yeah. Turn up a bit, Mark. That just came out. Walking down the street just the other day, a horrible thing crossed my way. It was big, as big as a house. It came for me, it was as big as a tree. And to attack! Ah! And to attack! Ah! And to attack! Ah! Ah! It was an ant attack! Oh. <laughs> I ran as fast as my legs were carrying me through a town and up the tree. From that place I saw a scene. I was terrified by what had been. It was an ant attack. Ah! Ant attack! Ah! Ant attack! Ah! It was an ant attack! Oh. <laughs> Quick, run away! Run away! Run away!
who ain't got nothing in it for you. But I say to you, brothers and sisters, 72 has highly significant significance for you. Now, I tell you, if you believe in 72, you believe in it totally. And you believe it's bullshit because it is. But if you believe it, then one day, one day, friends, one day, you will receive an enlightenment from on high in the moment of renunciation of the old worldly values which you may hold. However, dearly, you will see the significance of 72 and in this 73. <laughs> Thank you.